Good evening, everybody. It's Patsy from Patsy's Crochet. I have some new yarn here. Um, I'm just going to try out um, a James C. Brett a baby style, uh, style craft baby yarn and a paint box pod. And I have three sets of crochet hooks. So one one yarn would be for one set, you know, and the next set would be the next set. Had to come on today to keep my mind busy. Um, Christmas went really good. Um, my boyfriend Mike was outside helping um, Maria out. Maria wasn't here, but the snow was so high in front, he didn't want anybody walking outside without it getting shoveled. So he went outside and was being nice and shoveled up the sidewalk for everybody so they can walk their dogs and stuff. Well, when he came back in, he um, fell to his knees and he was always a ghost. Called my daughter down, um, figured out what was going on, and they called 911. Um, he had a heart attack. Um, we gave him two aspirin 81 at first from a friend of mine across the hall. And then the paramedics came and gave him another two stronger ones. They took him to Niagara Falls, then they transferred him right to Hamilton General, where he had surgery. They were prepped and ready for him. When he got there, uh, they cleaned out the clogged artery and put a stent, a stent in, his, in his valve. So far, everything's okay. He's laughing and he's talking to me all the time, all day today. Uh, my daughter and my son-in-law just took him up some stuff into Welland Hospital because Welland Hospital does not have no COVID-19. They were going to transfer him back to Niagara Falls, but it had a lot of COVID-19. They didn't want that. No one does, but they took him to Welland. And right now he's doing good. He's talking, laughing. You know, he's feeling a lot better now. He knows what he can't eat, what he, you know, I try to warn people about having fatty foods all the time it's not healthy for anybody but if everybody could say a prayer for him that'd be really appreciated um i don't want to cry so i'm gonna get on with the to, um to show you okay okay first one we're going to use is my new paint box yarns uh chunky pots uh, this one is 200 grams, 7 ounces, 272 meters, 297.5 yards, 100% acrylic. And this one is called Sweet Dreams. It says to use a uh, 10 USA needle needle or 4 UK or 6 millimeter crochet hook. So, like I said, we're going to try out my new, one of my new sets on this one, and another new set on the other one, and another new set on the other one. So this is my Knitter's Pride. So we're going to start with the number six. Really beautiful hooks. Really. I love the colors. Let's see how they do. And this yarn is so sweet and pretty. Oh, just bear with me. <laughs> I have to do this. Okay, so. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's not bad. Okay, now we're going to do a double, have a double crochet into the second chain from the hook. One, two, three, four, five. Six, not bad. Seven, eight, and nine. This is that good. Look at that. It went right through. And these knitter pride needles are nice. They're really nice. So that's the first row. That's with the number six. So this is just the Knitter Pride set. Sorry, I have to put it back in. I don't want to lose it. Don't want to lose this pot. Oh, they have a little, uh, there we go. Okay. 
Okay, so the next one we're going to use is a number 550. I'll put them back in after. They're a little tight getting in. They have little threads or something holding it. And I can't go see them because I have a little bit of a head cold. You know, so that's the sad part too. You want, um, but it's, it's better this way. Okay, so now we're using a 550. Okay. I like the yarn, really. This is a 550, this is good too. And the yarn stretches, eh? Wow. And it's soft. <clears throat> okay, that's the number five in the Knitter's Pride. Or oh, sorry, 550. Yeah, 550. This is a five. We're going to put this down to a four, okay? Then that gives us a five hooks. Okay, so this one is a five. Oops. Four. Five. Okay, look at that. That is good. So this is a number five. So we know the six and the five fifty and five work good. And this is with Knitter's Pride. Now we're going to try the 450, if I can get it out. <laughs> it's got to be another way of using this thing. Okay, these are really bright colors. So this is the 450 of the Knitter's Pride. Not bad. It was right through it. And the yarn is so nice. Wow. I've never tried the pods. I like the pods. I love the colors. Okay, so that is a 450. It went right, right through. And we got one more we're going to try with this one. And it's a number four. Because I just want to show you that different hooks smaller or the bigger they go through and that's what I like see so you got the six you got five and a half five and four that is pretty now this is a four not bad they just go right through My boyfriend got this one off Amazon for me, and it was a pretty hefty price, but they are amazing hooks. Wow. Okay, I'm not going to snap this one off because I want to wander back up. So, look at the colors. It's just gorgeous colors. We didn't get to those colors yet, though. <laughs> so, we got a six, five and a half, five, four. Oh, sorry. A six, five, five and a half, a four fifty, and a four. So there you go. That is nice. Nice. Look, it stretches too. It's beautiful colors. Okay, I'm just going to take this one quickly away and then put those hookers away. And then we're going to do the, the bamboo ones I got. And then the higher, higher ones are last. And that's from Ophelia Talks. So Tori, 
the box that I sent Tori on the 1st of December finally, finally hit Calgary today. So she'll be getting her box tomorrow. And hopefully she'll do an opening like a month. I've never seen that happen. Okay, so that is the first one. I'll put the, the crochet hooks away later because they're a little bit tight getting in. Okay, where is the paperwork for this now? <laughs> Did my dog get away with it? Okay, well, I'll find that afterwards. <laughs> okay, now we're going to use this super soft baby double knit James Seabret. Now, it doesn't tell you what size of needles. It just says 100 grams. It doesn't tell you anything else. And it says, excuse me, a shade BB2 dye lot is 50033. 500, and I know it's lemon because I have the paperwork with me. But it's not telling me what size knitting needle to use or crochet hooks. So to me, I'm going to pretend this is like um, style craft decay. Okay, and what we're going to use with this one is those bamboo ones. Now I put them all nicely in there because I can still get some more in there. I like to have one case. <laughs> okay, so what we're going to do, we are going to try the six. Is this the six bamboo? No, that's the five. Oh, okay, we're going to try a number six in the bamboo. Now, I never tried these bamboo ones before, okay? And I just hope it doesn't split. They almost look like a Susan Bates hook. Okay, one, two, three. I wish they had a shine on them, though. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Double crochet into the second chain from hook. Oops, sorry. Oh. Yeah, yeah. This is really thin with for number six here. <laughs> okay. Oh. I see. I really don't want to take that one off either. I'm sorry, people. What I could do is go like this and then glue it right back on. Yes. There. We'll glue it right back on. Okay. Probably, I think it'll look better with the, the smaller hooks. So this, this is number six. Okay. Okay, that's number six of the bamboo. Now, we're going to try a five. We're going through. I like the shiny ones. They don't have no nicks in it. Two. Oops. Oh boy. Okay. Oh, 
Okay. There we go. Okay. So it's a little slower with these bamboo. This is the number five. So what number is this? A four. We'll try one more on the other. No, four, six, five, four. Well, maybe we'll try two more. We'll do the threes. Oh, I didn't sleep at all last night and talked to Tori, I talked to Allison, Russell. I try my best not to cry because I cry too much. I think I'm allergic to my tears. <laughs> okay, so this is a number four. Now, I don't know about these small ones, man. This is a 3.5, really tiny. <laughs> Get my tension tighter, I think. Ooh. Oh, I don't know about this. Maybe with different hooks, they'll probably work better. Not with these. These, like, they have no gloss on these bamboo ones. Sometimes you can buy, uh, buy the bamboo ones. But these are good. Maybe just keep them for economic ones. They're made from real bamboo, they said, but mm, I don't know. I don't want to shred this wool or the yarn. Very beautiful yarn from James C. Brett. Okay, I'm not going to use a three on this. Oh, sorry, just can't. That's a 350. So if you're going to use anything like a bamboo one, Try maybe different kinds of bamboo. I can maybe try one of the higher, higher ones. Oops, 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 they went down. Sorry. Okay, let's try this one out. It's really tiny. Let's try 250. Why not it? Okay. Might as well. Why not? Yeah, it's doing better than that bamboo, I'll tell you. This is really tiny. Wow. It's be good for that um that yarn I have in there from uh, hobby. Um Yeah, that would be. Take me a while to finish this shawl neck, so. Okay. All right. Okay, so that is from mainly, mainly all these ones. So see if they had a little bit more gloss on them. They have no gloss. So. Okay. So I'll just take this off and we'll wander back up and we'll go on with the higher higher hooks and the Starcraft baby. Oh. Mmm. There we go. There we go. All right. 
I don't want to wreck this yarn. This is beautiful yarn. My heavens. I've never tried it before, so. Let's roll back up and I'll take the label back onto it. Okay. That one goes there. That's beautiful. Okay. So the next one, we're going to try the higher, higher hooks. Okay, this one stay up there. Put that one back up there. This one goes back in here. Okay, so we're going to start off. Let's see what it says. A four knit needle, four millimeter knit needle. 322 yards, 294 meters. So beautiful. Baby double knitting, wonder soft by Stylecraft. I can't believe this. Man. Oh, I got the wrong end here. Sorry. It's okay, I gotta roll, roll, roll it back up if I have to. And yes, I have to. <laughs> okay, so what I'll do is I'll roll it back. I'm not wasting this chart, <laughs> but it was a big knot. And I didn't want to have you guys sit here and wait while I do it. Okay. So what we're going to do, what number is this one? We can use a six. We'll start all of our numbers off with six, don't we? But I think the smaller ones look good with this. Yeah, let's go with the smaller. What size is that? We'll go with the four and up, like four and down to two. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hello, Haya. These are so gorgeous hooks. Two. This. You hear Bentley snoring in the background. So I got my webcam and the new spring thing for it today. I don't know how to use this webcam. Um, it looks like I have to plug it into my computer to do it and um, I need help with that because I don't see a thing where I could turn you know how when people do it okay well I'm at the end of the row and then they flick it to the next page I don't know how to do all that okay so this higher higher size 4 works put that right there now what number is this one? Oh, sorry that was a 450 that we just used so we're going to use the four now, which that is pretty. This yarn is super. My tension's a little too loose. Four, five, six. Okay. Oh, there's more there. Okay. So we did a 450 and a 4 from higher, higher. Now we're going to do. Oh, there's 375. Wow. Got all of them in the set here.
Okay. So we used a 450, a 4, and a 375. Not bad stitches, I'm telling you. That's beautiful. What number's that? Oh, now we're going to use a 350. Look at that. It's nice colors, eh? And this one is called Jack Horner. Horner. <laughs> beautiful colors. So this is a 350. So this way said, so that's the 375 we used. Now we're using a 350. That's the one that I usually use for Stylecraft, 350 or 3. But the 375 ain't bad either. Okay. Not bad, not bad. That's the 350 of the higher, higher. What's this one? It's good to try out new ones, eh? Oh, there's a three. <coughs> Sorry. Oh, not bad, not bad. Oh, look at the nice. <coughs> Sorry. I have, it's not COVID. It's just a normal head cold come on from different sizes of winter here. That's why I couldn't go see Mike today. That is pretty colors. It's coming in. Wow. Okay, so this is a three millimeter. Put it back in there so we don't lose it. Look at the colors. Beautiful colors. So that was a three. Let's try something. Yes, let's try something. Let's try 250. Look at these stupid little things. Oh, that's a two. 250. <laughs> Look at this tiny little thing. I had to come on and see you guys. Wow, it works. Knock on wood. Wow. I'm amazed. This gives you smaller stitches, but that looks beautiful. Okay, so we used, oh, sorry, I'm not dropping you. So we used, what was it? A 450, a 4, a 350, 375, a 3, and a 250. Okay, so that was a 4, 350, 375, <laughs> a 3, no, I got that wrong. A four, a three fifty, three seventy five, three, a three fifty. No, sorry, a three, and then a two fifty, right? Right. But the colors are gorgeous and it's soft. I gotta wind this ball up because I had to take this little lump out. But gorgeous, I know what I'm gonna make with these things. <laughs> Well, thank you so much for joining me today. Um, like I said, I got my webcam um, and another stand. I just have to learn how to use it. It's an HD one. It has a lot of reading. Um, so I'm hoping that I can get it going and learning how to um, get it that I can point it anywhere. And it'll take a good picture of what we're doing. 
you know, for that cowl, I wanted to make sure that everybody can see the cowl that we're doing. I'm um, hoping that people are going to join in on the cowl and let me know how many people want to join in so that way I know. Um, it would be really beautiful if we can, you know, at least get 10 to 16 people doing it. Um, that'd be awesome. But, um, just let me know because we are going to be using Stylecraft DK yarn. So I hope most of you have that, the colors. I will let you know in about a week, maybe in a week. I don't know when I'll be back on right now because I have a lot on my mind and I'm worried about Mike. I just want to make sure that he gets home safely and, and you know, take care of him for a little bit. But I will be on to do a chit chat and see how everybody's doing. Um, I love you all and thank you so much. God bless and say a prayer for Mike, will you please? Thank you so much for watching. Bye bye. I love you all.